Hi, it's your coach, Joe Lucas. Welcome to your Practice Power Daily Coaching video for Wednesday, May 14th, 2014. And here we are in the middle of the middle of the week, well, the middle of the month, right? And uh, summer's right around the corner. I usually have a Memorial Day chat, and I'll save that for a couple weeks. But I want to start having this conversation this morning about belief sets. You know, I, you know and I, the reason why I bring this up is when we did our Dallas uh, Mastermind a couple weeks ago, uh, one client of mine, very successful advisor, I mean, truly is successful, balanced, fit, athletic, all the above, economically, extremely successful. And he freaks out sometimes when he leaves the office to go on trips and vacations and trainings and stuff like that because what happens if the clients are not happy with? And, you know, it goes into that belief. And that's a person that travels to Eastern Europe, uh, Cuba. I mean, you know, you want to talk about getting out of touch, right? And then he's planning an African safari uh, next year for several weeks, right? So the bottom line is why? Why get stressed? And, and so, you know, he came to the meeting and he said, you know, I really feel guilty about being out of the office so much. And first thing you have to realize, this person has a great team, clients are well served, things like that. And it was interesting about his psychology, his belief set, right? So after we all talked about it, and, and see my belief has always been, with technology today, as much as we think it's a pain in the butt sometimes, it is a tool of liberation. It allows us to get out. And if you really pull and ask your clients, do you A, care if I sit in the office and don't pick up the phone or respond to you, or B, I'm accessible to you, right? So what is it, me sitting here physically in the office really doing nothing, right? Playing office or shopkeeper, or if you need to get a hold of me, if I'm accessible to you is what matters. And with technology today, you know, everybody's on their cell phones. Some people are cutting the cord to their home phones. What really matters in society today is accessibility. So getting back to my story. So over the last week or so, he's actually talked to some of his clients about being out of the office, taking these trips, you know, doing the iAdvisor thing, right? Bucket list, so on and so forth. And what's been interesting, the feedback he got, which was great news, was they were excited for him. They were okay with it as, as long as they're being well served and they can get a hold of him and they know he's got a really good team behind him, then it's okay. Yet so many advisors, in essence, so many of you, are so wrapped up in, man, I can't get any downtime because one of my client needs me. Once they call, you know, and look, this is not a prison. It's not a job. It's a business. You have staff or you at least have staff, whether it's whether they're on site or virtual, you have coverage. And if you don't have coverage, then let's talk about your model. Because obviously there's a flaw in the system, your system. Bottom line before we say goodbye this morning is let's make sure that we understand that do not be a shopkeeper. Do not hang out in the office waiting for that phone to ring so you can feel important or, or feel like you served well. Make sure you're out doing the things and you educate your clients in a very nice way. Hey, it's all about accessibility, not about whether or not I'm sitting at my desk or not. So have a great Wednesday. I'll see you tomorrow.